welcome dear student on my channel today we'll do practical of study of plasmolysis by using epidermal peel of tradescantia plant in this video you will find complete explanation and the answers of the practical at the end so here you can see the tradescantia plant how it is how it looks you can watch clearly how is the difference between the upper and lower epidermis so this is about the tradescantia leaf we can clearly watch lower surface which is a pink color upper surface which is a green color so that's why we are taking this leaf we want to take the low, lower epidermal peeling so that we can easily watch the process of plasmolysis we need we need the forceps we need the needle two slides and the two cover slips one is for the plasmolysed cells other is for the normal cells we need sugar solution concentrated sugar solution which is a hypertonic solution hypertonic solution another one we we need the hypotonic solution for which we will take the distilled water so distilled water which is a hypotonic solution now we'll take the leaf we'll take the fresh tradescantia leaf and peel off its lower colored surface in such a way that epidermal cells can be observed so easily we can take out we'll cut this with the help of the blade we need the only epidermal cells which is of single layer so thick portion will remove and we'll take the thin epidermal cells which is the epidermal layer we'll keep this in the center of the slide and on that we'll put the drop of distilled water which is a hypotonic solution slowly we'll put the cover slip on it first touch the cover slip to the water and then from the lower side keep the needle and slowly release that cover slip so that there will not be any air bubble excess of water that will remove with the help of the filter paper so that our slide will be neat and clean now that slide will keep under the compound microscope under 10x power of objective fix the position of the slide approximately now watch under the microscope through the ipis which is of 10x power get the maximum source of light through the concave mirror adjust the position of the slide so that we can watch the epidermal cells clearly first we'll do the rough adjustment screw adjustment with the help of rough adjustment screw then we'll do about the fine adjustment screw now the exact position is there now we'll watch this first we'll just check how is the distance is there this distance between the objective and the slide should be one finger distance approximately so that we can get the rough idea about that particular object now we'll fix the position of the slide with the help of the clip carefully we have to keep now we'll watch through the eyepiece on the lower side just now i said it is of the 10x objective from the upper side 10x eyepiece is there through that we'll watch so this what we are getting here this is about the lower epidermis where all cells are there which are full of protoplasm which is a colored sap is there so which are normal cells are there which is a full of protoplasm pink color protoplasm that's why we are taking the lower epidermis lower epidermal cells so this is one of the slide we can get the clear idea so maximum cells we shows a colored sap that's why the color of the leaf from the lower side it is a pink color now we have to prepare the another slide with the help of the hypertonic solution same way we'll take the lower surface small piece of the epidermal cells and place it on a slide same way the thick portion will remove with the help of the blade 
and now on this epidermal cells we'll put the drop of concentrated sugar solution which is a hypertonic solution same method will follow take the cover slip touch it to the solution and then slowly from the lower side put the needle and slowly release this cover slip and excess of the sugar solution you have to remove with the help of the filter paper this slide again will keep it under objective of compound microscope which is again the 10x power fix the approximate position watch it get a rough idea adjust the source of the light through the concave mirror and now we'll watch this so here we can get the clear idea how the plasmolysis have taken place all the protoplasm colored sap is there which start shrinking because of this is kept under the hypertonic solution so whole whatever the colored sap is there which is a plasmolyzed easily we can observe this so this is the process is there about the plasmolysis during this process approximately 4 to 5% of the water passes through the cell membrane into the medium this takes place because of the concentration of the water inside the cell is a higher than the outside the cell so the solution which occupies space between the wall and the protoplasm of plasmolysis cell is a hypertonic solution we can clearly watch through this